My name is Troy Leckemann. I'm from Switzerland, currently living in Austria. I'm 25 years old and I've been training for 10 years now. I would say injuries are just a part of the game. Like they're just part of the sport, what you do. And I think it's really important that they exist because you learn a lot from them. So like my first proper experience I had with injuries was when I broke my leg broke my leg like that was two two and a half years ago and that was like the injury where I realized okay this is bad like this is not what I want this is this, this stops me from training and um, I mean before that there were just smaller injuries like rolled ankles and stuff like that but when I broke my leg it was like okay I definitely did something wrong and I started to to think about that like what what was my what was the mistake what did I do wrong and uh, there were a lot of different um, factors that were included in that so like when I realized that when I train by myself when I just do what I really want then I don't get injured injuries only happen then when you kind of try to push yourself you try to push yourself in front of others for example or in front of a camera that's another example especially nowadays where you have like all the social media and you're trying to impress other people and for example you're trying to do something that you're not even sure you can do but if you can make it and it's on camera wow you get a lot of likes but since my injury I'm definitely aware of that that it's not worth it it's not worth it when you, you push yourself that much that you get injured so um, that was definitely a big lesson and yeah even though I know this I still don't do it all the time so I, that's like the thing that bothers me the most because I know okay if you don't feel the jump just don't do it it's really not worth it but sometimes you really like you want to do it because yeah just you want to try but then an injury happens and that's even more annoying. <laughs> I mean, yeah, that's the thing. The older you get, the more you realize how important your body is and that you have to take care because you only have this one body and this is, yeah, this is what you need. Um, so warming up is like the number one thing. Like I'm sure everyone knows that, but not everyone do it. Like including me, like I'm not warming up properly all the time, even though I know it. And uh, that's definitely something I learned uh, the past few years, that just take your time, warm up until you feel ready, you feel ready to do the, the, all the jumps. <laughs> uh, yeah, just take it serious, like don't rush anything, like you have time and that, I think that's also something that changed in my training over the past few years, that I don't do big jumps all the time. It's more like, okay, just do chill things because this is what you can do forever. Like, I think you can train until you're like 70. If you do small things like rolling around on the floor and just don't, like no big impact and all this. And, um, yeah, it's just, um, it's just what you want to do, I think in the end. So if you want to do big jumps, then you have to deal with it that you might be injured or that your knee hurts or whatever but if you just feel like moving around then i'm sure you can be able to train until you're 80 probably not 80 but for a really long time i'm sure <laughs> so probably the last few years i was injured quite a lot or just sometimes and what i learned from the injuries is that try to accept them like it doesn't matter like if you if you're like Oh, why did I injure myself? Why did I do this? And why did it? Why did I do it wrong? Like that really doesn't help. Like the best way, the best thing to do is just to accept the injury in your head, and I'm sure that then it heals quicker as well. Because um, I'm really sure that your entire body, like how you progress or how injuries heal, is all in your head. So if you believe that you get stronger again if you believe that this heals up it will heal up a lot faster because I know a lot of people they are injured and they they're so like, they have so many bad thoughts about that like ah oh, why 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 but instead of those thoughts just change them to the opposite and make them become good thoughts and you're like 
okay, I feel a lot stronger today and and then you just heal up quicker. Like that's a fact, like this is what I learned with all my injuries.